Hola, my name is Rafi, and I'm a party citizen from DC. <laughs> I'm a podcaster and personal trainer here in Washington, DC, and I'm just chilling at Gravelly Park watching planes land at Ronald Reagan Airport. What are you doing? So something here in DC we do is taking our happy hours into our own hands. We had a stressful day at work, and me and Nunu Paris are here having just a couple drinks, kicking and having a good time. So we're here being the messiest podcast, and something that we do is Tell you what not to do. We're wait, don't do it. My name is Rafi Manzor, and this is the Dame of DC, New New Paris, and our podcast is about inclusivity, about uplifting voices who aren't are usually seen in the mainstream culture. When we moved up here, we didn't immediately we came in with the fantasy that we were going to be accepted by the gay community as queer LGBT people and the gay capital of America. Did you know that actually? <laughs> and when we were welcomed to was a space that was not as diverse as we explained. We were tired of being overheard, overlooked in our community, and decided to start a podcast where we told you what not to do in DC. Things to do and not to do. And something we definitely told people to do is uplift their stories and make themselves the main characters in their roles. And party. <laughs> <laughs> Work. That's yes. true. Speaking of party and community, something I believe that we always do in DC is make our own parties. So we usually go to Gravity Park, we usually go to Malcolm X Park, and have our own brunches. Because sometimes the bouncers in D.C. don't like to have fun. And I think that we like our open space and creating our own rules here. So come join me. We're going to get to one of my favorite spots on D.C. And I'm going to give you a hint. It's on U Street. See you there. Well, first of all, don't schedule anything. Don't have a schedule that day. Choose the spot that you have faith in. Do something outdoors. A rooftop. This is a big rooftop city. Pass out probably at an effective hour like 9.30. So you can do it all over. A bike on a suit and that is literally That DC. is it. That is literally DC. I hate it. That is it. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. <laughs> Everyone's gonna have two DC tacos, and then two Thai shrimp tacos, and then uh, chips and queso. So DC has a great brunch and happy hour uh, culture. I believe that's our biggest culture in nightlife, only because when the sun's out, we like to go out. I think it's a city where we have a lot of transient people, so late 20 year olds, and I feel like the thing about late 20 year olds is that we like a good time, but we also like a, a sturdy bedtime. <laughs> So this is what I get every time at All Right, which is the nachos and queso. But no, get an extra large queso, because you always run out afterwards. But then there's the DC taco. In DC, we have mumbo sauce and fried chicken wings. That's like the nightlife food here. And so in a taco, you have that. You have fried chicken, mumbo sauce, and fried like onions. I can't wait for you to taste it. Then we have the Thai shrimp taco. It gives our pad thai down the street in the taco shell and it, that spicy mayo i don't i hope it's spicy mayo but it tastes out of this world honestly and then we have i mean the cream of a crop the best pitcher of frozen margaritas in dc this is the normal weekday <laughs> you know i'll be here tomorrow wednesday thursday and friday <laughs> something that inspires me for sure is my story i'm not gonna lie to you i think um, looking back at old pictures of me sometimes inspires me because I see a different person who hide it from a camera, who didn't smile in front of a camera. And I think now, I think I'm trying to learn to embrace, like I said, embrace your main character energy. Because uh, you never know who's watching you and seeing something completely different. And so that's something that I've tried to instill is stepping into your power, stepping into your magic. Because someone else is seeing it when you don't see it. Rafi, are you saving that for later? Wait, what? <gasps> <laughs> Only for the camera, though. Mm -hmm. You know it's the Drag Dynasty today, right? What's that mean? It's Drag Dynasty. The eight queen competition, Chata, all the girls are there right now. Oh my god, okay. So it's gonna be, you don't wanna miss this. So make sure we're gonna be there in like 15 minutes. Where's the Uber? All right, do you wanna go in the back this time? DC has so much community, so much culture. It was called Chocolate City for a reason. There is so much flavor here that needs to be just like, untapped and I feel like it doesn't go back to enough. 
Hola right, amigos, we're at DuPont Italian Kitchen for DuPont Dynasty, where the girls are about to go head to head like RuPaul's Drag Race to see who's the queen of DuPont. Let's find out. Now this is why you come to DC, baby. And always make sure to bring cash. All right, everyone, thank you for joining me tonight. This was my Monday night. I hope you had a fun time. I'm at Dick Bar. If you're ever in DC, hit me up. I'm gonna keep having fun though. I'll see you there. <laughs> Did you think I was gonna go up the stairs? <laughs>